Well, here it is, uh, <laughs> Thursday in Gerald, Texas at Bar 111 Knives. And uh, as, as you can tell from the sign up there, my boys gave me that sign, uh, thinking I needed to put that in the shop since I kind of had a little uh, a, a, a problem with the hammer the other day. But anyway, I did get a couple of knives made, and I want to share them with you, or one knife made uh, that I finished up uh, today. Kind of having a little slow at it, but I did finish one up, and I want to share it with you just a little bit. Uh, right here it is. This is just a really a nice everyday carry knife that we got right here. Uh, uh, the, the handles were made by Glenn out of Oklahoma. It's Choya Cactus. It's blue, as you can see, a dark blue. Kind of got an upsweep blade on it. I have not sharpened it yet. Fits real nice in your hand. Got a little taper, a uh, little swell to it in the middle. I really like the feel of this knife. I think anybody that gets a go hold of this knife is really going to like it as well. It's a good size knife to have out in hunting. But anyway, uh, there it is. And I'll guarantee you what, and when I get through putting the edge on this one, this some gun's going to be sharp as a tack. Make the man of your life look like he knows what he's doing. And the same way with you ladies, if you happen to be carrying this, you're going to look like you know know exactly what you're doing. But the men are going to be chasing you because they're going to want to take this knife away from you. But anyway, y'all let me know what you think. It's Bar 111 Knives uh, letting you see what we got. i got to get my name on it and put an edge on it, but it sure is a pretty little thing. By the way, uh, the, the, the thing I've been working on when I happened to have a, a, a conflict with my hammer was a Model A leaf spring, uh, which I did get it flat and leveled out, but uh, I had to stop for a few days. As you can tell, that was a pretty good lick, and uh, there wasn't much they could <laughs> left for them to do to it. At least it didn't break any bones, and I still got my finger. But anyway, letting you all see it and let you know what it's, uh, what, what, why I've been slow on getting out uh, videos on my knives. This Bar 111 Knives comes to you from Gerald, Texas, making America beautiful and sharp one knife at a time. See you now. Bye.